my whole life has been documented. Yeah, yeah. There's not one minute of my life that hasn't been documented. But how do you feel about that? I mean, how do you feel about not having had a, I would a feel private moment? I would feel extremely bad not having it on camera. Really? Uh, that's, how, that's how natural it is to me. Mm. I believe, like, we all grow because we share our experiences. I'm just fascinated about the way she lives her life entirely on television. Her life is a reality show. There's no distinction. Mm -hmm. Excuse me a second, Kevin. I'm so, no, I'm so sorry. No, 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 no. Don't it. do not. Because I'm, I'm completely fascinated by what Yeah, I love it. I love that. Yeah, it's interesting. You live in your moment and you believe that you're doing what's right, what's, what's healthiest, happiest, best for you and your life. You better own that. You better stand up and you say, I'm proud of myself. I have faith. Like, this is... You know, this is me, this is my decisions, this is my life. You should never live your life for other people, mm. ever. Mm. You know, be like, have, have respect. Do you, know you say you should never live your life for other people, ever? Live your life for other people. Did I hear you say you should never live your life for other people, ever? Count me out. I don't agree with you. Yeah. Go on then. Explain though. You mean don't let other people influence? Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's, that's what, what I mean. she means, and that's and I'm sure she, I'm sure Edwina would agree if she yeah, if she that's knew. what I meant. But you can't say you should never live your life for other people ever. No, she meant just in terms of making decisions for yourself. You can't be well. No, by. sometimes you have to make decisions that benefit other people and put yeah, you I'm at sure a disadvantage. Sure, she does with her children all the time. I'm sure with your kids, it's You're a different a mother. ball game. Yeah, yeah, mother. Yeah, but her kids that, are part of her now, so her yeah, kids become I, part of I her think decisions. It's a part, I think the, the yeah, kids are excluded you, from that, I'm really. I'm sorry, sometimes you put other people first. It just kicked off from there. It was awful, awful to be there. Sometimes you put other people first. Mm -hmm. Being here is the right decision, and I'm not going to let you or you or anyone tell me that that's the wrong decision. You, I'm going to tell you it's the wrong decision. You can't stop me doing what I think is right. So there. That's the problem with that philosophy. Because then you have everybody saying, I'm going to do my thing. And nobody does anything together. But you're not, you're not seeing the heart of what we're saying. So you might as no, well not. shut the up and get the out of our conversation because you're not seeing the heart of it. So you take your heartless your ass, me, take your heartless ass out of our conversations, shut the f up and go back to sleep where you belong. And she just went off on one. See, it was one of those moments that I was like, is this actually happening right now? Hey, heartless Dad. ass f politician, shut the f up. Kendra, 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 I down, beg your don't, pardon. Calm down. Who the if f just says that shit? I've upset you, I'm sorry. The last thing I wanted to do was upset her or indeed upset anybody. But boy, it was like putting a taper to a rocket and off she went. <laughs> You're a grown ass <laughs> woman starting shit with a young that. woman like this, ta trying to be a heartful, trying to be heartful and try to put myself out here like this, trying to help others and inspire people. And you come in with your devilish ass, heartless ass piece of shit self and trying to damage Kendra, me. Kendra, Kendra, Kendra. No, Kendra. you. Those who use foul language are doing so because they're failing to make a proper argument. Kendra, you can't dominate me, so don't try. Oh, oh my God. Queen of England? You're queen of England now? You're the queen of the jungle yeah. now? Yeah. When I believe that someone thinks that they're better than everyone else, then that's when I'll just, I have to put them in their place. Please calm down. You don't care that she, if she says or judges you. You don't know the woman. I was like, I need to physically take her out of the camp for a minute and calm her down because she was getting so passionate and so frustrated. I was just having a moment. Of like, course. I was just pouring my heart out to you guys. And I was like, you know, like, she just totally came in at like the most vulnerable time and just like, I know, it was up. I'm very sympathetic to uh, Kendra, who I like very much, and I'm fascinated by uh, the way she lives her life and what she represents. I don't think Kendra is a selfish person, actually, but I'm not sure she's a moral philosopher either. We've spent our lives conducting debates and discussions about the most serious and, and extraordinary issues. But, but, but Kendra doesn't live in that world. She lives in a, she lives right. in a different bubble. But we do. We do not always have to make allowances when somebody doesn't live in our world. If you're going to set yourself up as a guru of a philosophy, hey, kid, defend it. But she didn't do that. And I think the way she behaved was very unwise.
women. He really loves these women. And are you are you obligated to have sex with him? Um, I moved in, and weeks went by, and I didn't know that sex was involved. Okay. So that was that's 